Hello YouTubers, Ronald Key Jr. here, and I got a live commentary video for you guys today. We're going to play with a older weapon in Battlefield 1, one of my favorite ones before, the M1907 SL Sweeper, because I need to play Medic for, um, there's some dog tag that you can unlock right now. I think you have to heal 100 teammates or something, so I'm going to try and get that. And this week I'm not going to forget to talk about the live stream schedule, um, and we're actually going to do that right now, so we're going to be playing today. Really? Really? Just sitting there? So yeah, we're gonna be playing Battlefield today at around 12 p.m. EDT. Uh, yeah, 12 p.m. EDT. Whatever that is in your time zone. Um, on Discord, if you guys are on there, I'm gonna put it in GMT plus one also. So you guys, so the people in Europe have an easier time figuring out what time that is for them. And tomorrow, um, maybe a little bit later, around three, I believe. That I'm gonna play 3 p.m. EDT, and then and tomorrow's probably gonna be a single player game. We shall see. Um, I did. Unfortunately, I reset. Well, when I formatted, I did not save the single player files for Wolfenstein. Um, so I do think that those were local files. And I believe I deleted all the save folders, so we'll probably have to start. How did I die twice already? Oh yeah, the guy with the shotgun, right? So yeah, I do believe that we might have to start over, but uh, that's not a big deal. I... This gun... Did this gun get fucking worse? <laughs> I can swear this gun was fucking amazing before. What the fuck happened? As this map is shit on TDM because of people camping on top. I don't know why they would allow people to go... I, st I still don't understand why they would allow people to go up on top of there on TDM. It's the same problem as Siege of Shanghai in Battlefield 4 and I've said it multiple times before. Uh, making mistakes over and over again. Whatever, I'm not a game developer, I don't know what the fuck I'm talking about. And then the... Yeah, the next, the next live stream is probably going to be on Wednesday. I don't know what time that's going to be at yet. Uh, it's going to be... It's going to be spoken of on the Discord. So if you guys haven't joined the Discord yet, you should, you should, you really should. Um, my moderators have put a lot of work into the Discord and it's actually really cool now. We have a lot of features on there, a lot of good stuff, a lot of good people. And now they actually just implemented a leveling up server for the TeamSpeak itself. Um, so now the more active you are, the higher you rank, and then at the end of each month, the highest rank of the server will get some kind of reward. Um, we haven't quite figured out what it, it's going to be yet. It might not be monetary, it, like something worth any money, um, but uh, there'll definitely be something for the top ranked uh, user. And what you have to do to rank is basically just interact with people, just talk and stuff like that. And yeah, it's really cool. So yeah, if you guys haven't joined the Discord, there's a link in the description. You guys can go check that out. Good place. And there's also going to be a lot of things happening in the couple of, next couple of weeks. Battlefront 2 is coming out. Turning Tides DLC is just around the corner. Um, there's already a lot of info being dropped on the CTE. So yeah, it's going to be probably a little bit chaotic for the next com next couple of weeks. Gaming wise, which is good, which is good. It's always good as I still get shot from some guy camping up top there, which is always fun So fun good map design dice And yeah, I want to know um, If you guys are actually actually bought Battlefront 2 I'd love to know which of my which of the subscribers and which of the community bought Battlefront 2 Oh shit! No, not- oh fuck, that was a rock again. Not only to know if you guys are gonna watch the videos, but to know your opinions on the game. What you think of the gameplay, what you think of the leveling system, progression, all that stuff. I swear this gun got fucking worse <laughs> since I've used it. Maybe it's just because I'm not used to the recoil anymore because I haven't used it in so long.
Holy fu- Oh, Parabellum. Yeah, there's nothing I could do against Parabellum right there. Too good close range. Way too good. So yeah, there's a big debacle over the progression system in Battlefront 2. Um, I don't want to talk about it in this video, but um, there is a lot of stuff uh, happening if you guys aren't in the loop very much. Basically, they're being called out for the system being a pay to win. Which is m uh, more than partly true, not gonna lie. I've made a few videos on it, but I haven't really- oh shit. I haven't really get, made like a, 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 a full detailed video on that. I might eventually. Um, but they have come forward saying that they're going to change a couple things, which is good. And there's also been the uh, problem with the specializations that are supposed to come out with Turning Tides. <laughs> which, uh, I don't know man, D Dice are having a hard time keeping their head above water right now. Like they don't, they, sometimes I feel like they don't know what they're quite, quite, quite what they're doing. Um, but they've also uh, come forward to say that they're going to either postpone the release of those uh, <laughs> those uh, automate teamwork automation specializations, or either completely take them out. But uh, there's no definitive. There's nothing definitive yet. But uh, there's definitely something happening there. The community was not too pleased with those specializations that are coming out. If you guys don't know what the fuck I'm talking about, I made a video on it. There'll be a card up in the top right hand corner. And you guys can go check that out. But uh, yeah, there's definitely <laughs> some work to be done there. Because I know that most of the community wasn't happy, including me. Hmm. I really need to get up there to try and clear it, but, uh... There's probably some fucking bombs waiting for me on the top of this ladder. Whatever. Fuck it. Live on the edge. Live on the motherfucking edge. Really want to clear this balcony. Fuck! No! I'm dead. Fuck. Aw oh, man, fucking... F shooting at me, fucking shooting rifle grenades, god. Not much I could do there. Oh, is he upstairs? Oh, he is! Oh, hell yeah! Fuck you! Oh, they're coming this way too. What the fuck? Don't. Don't get up. Oh my god, I think I'm alone up here now. Oh no, there's still this dude here. And this dude here running around. Ooh, that guy almost took me out. Holy shit. <laughs> I think we're almost done clearing this. I hope. This is boring. Want to patch you up? I really don't want to camp up here. I, fuck I thought I fucking heard somebody here. Guess not. Maybe not. Is there still somebody up there? Probably not. Probably just hallucinating things. It was a long ass weekend, but I have multiple days off. I worked like a fucking madman for like three days. But now I have four days off, which is bloody amazing. Hello? Nobody there. Jesus fucking am I gonna find people? Oh, there's one There we go find people to kill Nobody's around to run out halfway across the map to find people watch me get fucking domed Ah oh, man Fedorov is so so good so good So very good compared to most of the other medic weapons at close range There's a lot of people with high pings. I think they, I think their quick match setting is fucked up because every time I join a server, it either puts me 
It often puts me in servers, like, at the other end of the fucking world. And then I have, like, the high ping. And then, then, then people... And then I actually pick my servers. I'm in, I'm in my servers in my region, but... People who pick quick match have these incredibly high pings. Making it so that they hit it. Like, look at that, I was already around the corner and the shot just hit me. It's aggravating. I think the quick match needs a little bit of reworking. In order for people to join s games that are already in progress in their own region. I think that would be the best. Because these pings, man, these pings are killing us. <laughs> fuck. Oh, fuck, I'm out and I'm dead. Yep. <laughs> Dude came up behind me. Damn it. Damn it. That would have been such an awesome kill streak had I had a little bit more health and a little bit more bullets. How did the gas not affect them before? What the fuck is that? Dice! Fix your fucking hit detection! What the fuck is this? It's nonsense is what that is. Ooh, hi. My bad. Hallway of death, here I come! This is the hallway of death. This is... A shit show. <laughs> Everybody, everybody loves fighting here because it's closed choke point. You can just get like massive fucking damage. Ah oh, man. Oh, well, that was a pretty good game. Tried, I tried. So, uh, if you guys want to know the live stream schedule again, it'll be in the description down below or on Discord. Let me know in the comments down below what you think of uh, some of the stuff I talked about, like the <laughs> the specializations. Uh, coming out and turning tides, uh, Battlefront 2, the whole situation on that. What, if you buy the, if you bought the game, if you enjoy it, and when it comes out. And while you're down there, be sure to hit the like button if you enjoyed the video. Subscribe to the channel if you haven't already. Don't forget to join our Discord server. I know I'm annoying with this, but it's awesome, and you get all the info on there. And as always, thank you very much for watching. I really appreciate it. And I'll see you guys in the next video. Have a good one.